resume the crash position. Hold on tight. Take a deep breath for a new kind of cartoon show. to take you inside and turn the pages. Here are your hosts, Henry and June. Hey there, Kablamocrats. Welcome to Ka Welcome to... It's the new comic strip that moved in upstairs. Herman the Horrible. Horrible is right. Ever read that strip? Bunch of Vikings sitting around picking their noses. I'll take care of this. Pipe down, you nimrods! Step aside, little lady. Let a man handle this. Ooh, muy macho. Knocker. Hey, neighbor. Love the comic, man. Some funny, funny stuff. Say, I was just wondering, how come you young, good-looking Norsemen aren't out pillaging the countryside? Yeah, right, men, spillage! <laughs> Folks, my co-host is, um, how do we put this delicately? S stupider than Snizzle Fondue combined. Watch this and see if you agree. today. Oh! As decreed by the ancients, the hat shall not leaveth the noggin of the chosen one. I have spoken. No, oh, come on! Nope. Willy, well, well then. In that case, I'm gonna slam myself to the floor repeatedly until you loan me the hat! Neurological damage there. Oh, my poor Snizzy. Tell you what, when, when you get out of the hospital, I, I, I'm gonna loan you my hat for two whole hours. <laughs> Just for you, Mr. GQ. Handsome boy, fortune no charge. You have fantastic life. All three shabbies for the price of one. And of course, currency eludes me. You, you have the look that Deluxe Cinemas wants to see in more of its patrons. Skimbor, I find the atmosphere on this planet wonderfully intoxicating. You said it, Captain. Oh, fruits. He's probably halfway to Ecuador by now. He's only five minutes late. You are so naive. Get over yourself. It's just a stupid hat. You 
insensitive fool. That hat is my essence. Hey! I'm naked! Sport not. I found this old box of hats from when I did theater. Dig, man. So weak. You. Your two hours are so up, you little hat klepto. Hey, come on! That cap's working for me! Of course it is. That's the awesome power of Le Blue Chapeau. Observe how it works on the head of the master. Simone, nasty Frico directly behind. Satnan! <laughs> A wedge. Watch this. For you, free ice cream. Oh, wait. I'm forgetting the rainbow sprinklies. There, you see? I it's not the hat, it's Sniz. Hey, uh, Snizzy. Yes, sir? You can wear the hat some more. As much as you want. Mm, no, thanks. I need a new look, anywho. Now, don't you feel like a big, whiny baby? All that fuss over little headwear. Sheesh. Well, I... Going downtown and my baby's gonna be all right. <gasps> I just love my new look. Thanks. <laughs> Sniz and fondue, ladies and gentlemen. Pure chewing satisfaction. Look, Henry, a package from Herman. He must be apologizing for pillaging our set. All right. Nordicorific. No way. I'm not getting a hat head. The helmets. <laughs> While Lars helps me rouse Henry, check out some other head injured heroes. It's action lead now. Dateline Bill the Lab Guy's laboratory, where a beleaguered action leaguer turns to a trusted friend for help. Bill, can we talk for a minute? No, go away. You know what my problem is, Bill? I'm a joke. All I can do is melt. Big whoop. Is there any way you can give me some real powers? There's nothing I can do. I'm too busy working on a secret formula that makes people really big. Really big, huh? Loving you is easy cause you're beautiful. Do 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 do. I'm so in love with you. Hmm, minty. No, I was afraid of this. Hey, look at me. I'm Mega Melty. Meltman, that formula's not ready. It still needs to be tested. Test smashed. I'm living large now, baby. Yahoo! Ouch, ow, ooh. Sorry. Hurts, ow, medic. 
Action League. Now, starring The Flesh, he's super strong and super naked. Thunder Girl, she flies like thunder. Stinky Diver, a former Navy commando with an attitude as bad as his odor. And Meltman, with the power to melt. Today's episode, Meltman at Large. We find our heroes under a bed in the midst of a top secret action briefing. Okay, you guys, listen up. The president's in town next week. Thunder Girl, I'm going to need your super flying power. Flesh, your super strength. Stinky, your super sharp shooting. That's where Melt Man. Um. Um. Well, uh. He can get the donuts. Donuts, donuts, donuts. <laughs> <laughs> Think again, Pip Squeaks. Collars, Melty. You look different. Did you get a haircut? No, you moron. He obviously drank Bill's secret formula. Melt Man, you're suspended! Au contraire, Chiefster. You're suspended. All of you are. In the air. Hey! What are you doing? Ah, Let's put go! Me down! Not having fun. Action facts. It must be for Mega Meltman. Put us down, you freak. Oh! Trouble at Backyard State Park. Birthday party. Kids in danger. To the Action Mobile. Action, action League away! I've got Francis. Oh, I swear! Oh, jeez. Man, this car has zero leg room. Mountain Man, you idiot! We were those kids' only hope! Don't worry, Chief. I'll go solo on this one. Mega Melt Man away! Oh. Oh. Ouchies again. And so, as a mammoth melted meathead makes his way... Hey! Wait! Darn! Aw, crud! Two terrified tykes hang on for dear life. Can an inflated imbecile head off an inflated imbroglio? Stay tuned for the action-engorged conclusion of Action League Now. Action League Now. Meltman enlarged. Kids ensnared. The League en... smashed. As time runs out on a pair of petrified pre-adolescents, a big bozo races to the rescue. Sorry, pal. I don't have any cash and uh, no pockets. Never fear, young citizens. Mega Meltman is here. All right, it's Meltman, and he's big. We're saved. Hooray! I'm Mega Meltman with the power to. Ow! We're toast. Don't worry, young Americans. I'm out. Uh, Coming with my incredible super size. I'll. Uh, uh, just missed. Hang on. Don't quit your day job. Mega Meltman with the power to climb on a bench. Here you go, leaders of tomorrow. Now run along and play without fear. Thanks, Meltman. That's <laughs> Mega Meltman. Yeah, whatever. All right, Melty! Hooray for you! Bully! Good work, Mega Meltman! Thanks, Chief. Now, maybe we should discuss my mega salary increase. And how about a mega apology from the rest of you guys? Meltman, wait. There's something I have to tell you. Save it, Phil. I'm on a roll. Hey, what the... I was just going to say that the effect of the drug is temporary. Well, at least Melty got his raise. Boy, I'm sure gonna miss him. Me too. Who's gonna get us donuts? <laughs> <laughs> the end. Wow, that action league was... That's it! I'm stopping this insanity. What's that? 
it's the same super growth potion that Meltman just used. It's time to kick some Viking Heidi and take some Viking names. You can see it coming, can't you, folks? Without Henry, this show wouldn't be ah! half as entertaining. Here now, Prometheus and Bob. What you are about to see is top secret. It is a videotape recorded 900,000 years ago by an alien using a remote-controlled camera. It shows his attempts to educate a caveman. They have been codenamed the Prometheus and Bob tapes. Tape number 97, construction. Cartoon, they'll be so in touch with their feelings, they won't hurt a flea. Yells back! This is not going to end well. Psst. Wanna see what I'm thinking? There's all kinds of stuff in the head of the girl. I'm the girl, <laughs> with her head coming off. How come if you like a person, it's easy to make friends, but if you really like them, it gets so hard? I wish it could just be simple, like with my sister Jill and her new best friend Charlie. His name's Cousin Charlie. There's no way he's our cousin. And we have a new hobby. Ants! Look, this citizen ant has died. Now, its fellow citizens will work together to bring the body to the burial pile. Amazing, eh? But isn't it kind of sad? Jill, there's no sadness in the world of bugs. And in the world of me? All through math today, I was thinking about my biggest crush ever, Elvin. 
And then, just when I turned to look outside, it was perfect timing for him to go by. Look here, look here. Alice, look here. And he would have looked, too, if it wasn't for Mr. Poot. And as if that wasn't torture enough, when it was finally time to go home, I almost fell over him on the steps. He was sitting with Sedona Hayes, of course. Why wouldn't he be with her? They are both the ultimate. Nice motorcycle. Cool. Nice hat. Cool. It was almost like too much. Like their being together made a black hole of coolness. Elvin, I think you're sitting on my hair. Cool. When I got home, the ants had escaped. No stepping on the floor! Where the dickens is that bug spray? Bug spray? No! <sighs> Mom could tell I was too upset to help. I kept thinking about how they say, if you've got it, flaunt it. But what if you don't? Why do humans have to be so different? Why can't we be more like the ants? Citizen Alice, this stinking hunk of food will be most fine for the dawn of perfection ritual. Yes, we must transport it to the home of all others. Allow me to help fellow citizens, for all must be equal in our perfect bug society. However, there seems to be something more equal about you. Yeah? Brother! Sister! I, I can't hold this by myself! Mom decided to bug bomb the house. <coughs> Alice, please, take them for ice cream. Cousins, I'm thinking of number between two and seven. Fifty-four? That's it. Hey, Alice, isn't that your friend, that elven guy? Wild. He's so loud and so, so... Good catch. What are you doing? Well, you know how after a wedding, they tie all those cans and junk to the car so it makes that really cool noise? It's kind of like that. I bet if you put some pennies or, or little rocks in, you could really make a racket. Thanks. Hey, Dorko! We don't have all day. I guess I better go. Yeah, see you around, Dorco. After that, I just had to run. It was hard to figure out if I had scored coolness points or if Elvin had lost them, but who could care? And the next thing I knew, I was in a hopping race with Jill and Charlie, and you know, I didn't even mind calling him cousin. That's done. Now I can put my head back on. Who is responsible for showing us this cartoon? It was June's idea, I swear. I told her. Run for your lives! You are the shower of this cartoon filled with such sensitivityness! Uh, um, I thought you would like the car cartoon. It. I loved it! It was the most beautiful cartoon ever! Now, give Herman a hug! <sighs> the feelings! The emotion! The love! It makes us want to... Feel it! Feel it! Yes, if we can't beat them, join them. So we'll see you next time, Kablam Chops. Join us again next time. Same Kablam time, same Kablam network. <laughs> <laughs>